Merry Christmas we have had not the start to the day that I wanted for our magical Christmas away um, as soon as the boys woke up at like 5 45 they went out to where all the presents were and they were opening up the stockings and obviously there's stuff all over the floor from the stockings and the presents and everything and Jackson was even so excited and he was walking around everything and he tripped over something and he like basically like head butted the fireplace and he cut his eye so much like he's got a cut right here on his eyebrow bone and it was it was just awful like he, he it was so deep like when i looked at it it was so deep i i burst into tears and fraser was upset that i was upset it didn't bleed much it was just like this really open cut straight away and Jackson didn't even cry very much like he was still so excited about what's going on and I was holding him crying and he like wanted an orange and like he's honestly the hardest child in the world anyway I've rushed to A&E this morning and they've glued his head and they've put some stereo strips on it and um it's now it's not even eight o'clock yet all this has happened and I'm gonna go back now to see the boys they were so sweet I was just so upset because I've just been so upset because you know it's so much planning and so much build up to Christmas and you know I just really wanted to watch um, Fraser and Caleb open their presents he's fine um, yeah he's totally fine look at him he's just like talking but anyway I'm gonna go back and see the boys now um, I hope they have opened their presents but Matt was like, oh, maybe we won't open them. But I hope they have because, you know, that's the whole point. But uh, staff in the hospital were amazing. He's absolutely fine. But I just keep getting upset that he's going to have a scar on his little beautiful face. Oh, my God. It's the worst vlog ever. Right. Let's go. Oh, careful. It's heavy, that one. And I got some Wow. That's so good. Limited edition mattress. Jaxie, what you got? Right, we're back home now. Caleb opened all of his presents, haven't you? He got an iPad, and Fraser's just opening his now. Cause I saved them for mummy. Mama's killed. Mama, killed a monster. He's absolutely fine. I got saved. He's just loving life. Oh, you like him, don't you? Ah, uh, he's got it. What? Jasmine got me got plucked. Can't even plucked. You can only get it from the table. Here you go. You're making a cup of tea. Out of everything, that's your favourite, isn't it? A cup of tea. Yeah. <laughs> he's such a good boy. Christmas is thrown up in here. No. Oh, 
Toy Toy. Because because we need to be on a stable flat surface and to explore. Things have calmed down here now, thank God. Daddy's just taken baby Jackson out to have a nap in the buggy because the only way he was sleeping was on my shoulder and every time I tried to put him in the cot, he's just obviously very upset. This is Fraser's Minecraft potion that he got, which is such a cool light, like a isn't nightmare. it? And their favorite toys of the day are these Plants vs Zombies teddies. How many are there? There's loads, aren't there? No, I'll show you my favorite. Oh, what's your favourite toy? Cosmo. Cosmo. He got Cosmo the robot and that was the main present that he wanted. So he is over the moon. Fraser said it's been his best Christmas ever. Hasn't it? It's a robot. It's I, so I cute and you control it. it from an app on your phone. So it's super duper clever. Caleb is over there ODing on sweets. Still in his jammies, we need to get him dressed because it is like noon now and we're off to have lunch. I'm not cooking, which is amazing, especially from what happened this morning. We're going to a restaurant. So Matt's mum is actually coming up and joining us for that. So she'll be here any minute. We've got Soda Stream. <coughs> and we've got Soda Stream, which makes your drinks fizzy. Because we don't let the boys have fizzy drinks. But you could make fruit juice fizzy, you could make water fizzy, so this is perfect for you. Can I get some juice to make it fizzy? Yeah, I'm feeling much better now. I still feel like a little bit in shock, but I'm trying my best to be happy because the boys get really upset when I cry. So I'm not going to cry anymore in my voice, um, but I don't think that image of picking up Jackson after he fell and looking at his face with a gigantic gash on his perfect little eye there will ever leave me. Was mummy crying? Yeah. Sorry, bub. I'm not going to cry anymore. But yeah, now I'm going to get ready and we're going to go for Christmas lunch. So let's try and have a good day. I forgot to say as well that the Centre Park's paramedics came around um, just to have a look at Jackson because as I came back through the barriers I said, you know, we've just been to A&E, he hurt his eye, etc. So they sent two nurses around to check him over which was so sweet of them. They were so, so lovely and they, you know, they thought he looked fine and everything. And I was like, oh, you're working on Christmas Day? And they said, yeah, it's quite a busy day for... Um, like finger cuts because everyone seems to cut their fingers when they're carving the turkey so they said they literally just go round and round like fixing people's fingers so um yeah they had a look over him and they just said you know if we need anything like let them know so that was really nice of them but yeah everyone's been so nice but i think because it's such an obvious cut on Mommy, his face how you do it? oh i think you're working it out let me have a look i haven't read the instructions yet um, yeah, it's such an obvious thing on his face, like when you see Jackson, you, people are like, oh, and then it just makes me feel like the worst person ever, but he was just walking and I think because he's one, like the nurse at the hospital was like, we see it all the time because he can walk, but not very well and definitely not when there's obstacles like in the way. So all the Christmas presents and everything just made him trip up. So yeah, I, I am hoping that I'll get over this one day, <laughs> but Right, let's get ready and let's make some soda as well. Right, I've freshened up and I'm wearing my festive jumper and we're off. Daddy, I don't want to go back to hospital. No. Is it good? Yes. Yeah. 
inside. What's it say inside it? Yeah. That is really cool. Look at that. Does it? Yeah. You put Hi guys, it's nearly midnight now. I look horrendous <laughs> and Jackson is not sleeping. Well, he was sleeping, but he's just woken up. So I've given him some cowpole in case he's in pain or I don't know if he just like rolled onto his face and it hurt. Um, I've, I've been crying so much. You can see my eyes like really puffy. Um, but yeah, anyway, what a crazy Christmas day. I think we pulled it back in the end. The boys had such a good day. I didn't really film much this afternoon because my mother-in-law was visiting and we went for lunch and everything. Yeah, but we just hung out as a family, had cheese and biscuits, you know, the usual kind of stuff. Played with a million toys. And yeah, he seems totally fine. He's just wide awake. It is so late. I'm so tired because the kids woke up you know, like 5.30 this morning. Um, but yeah, thanks so much for watching. I can't believe I managed to actually vlog the whole day. I wasn't sure if I was going to because of the start this morning, but then I was kind of like, you know, I would like to remember this even though this happened. And I'm sure this is a day that we will be talking about for a very long time, whenever anything comes up about his little scar, if he has one. Um, but yeah, it's still, it's been a good day overall. <laughs> And one that we will definitely remember forever. So yeah, thank you so much for watching and thank you so much for all your support. I put a photo on Instagram of him and like, you know, a little rundown of what happened. And so many of you were like, the exact same thing happened to my child and they're fine. Or well, there was even a few people that like were paramedics and like just giving me advice and stuff. So yeah, it really means the world to me. It made me feel actually so much better because loads of you were like this exact thing happened to my child three years ago and you wouldn't even know you know that it ever happened so it made me feel a lot better but anyway i am really hoping he's gonna go to sleep soon and yeah i'll see you guys soon <laughs> bye